digestive system of hardmania the digestive system is complete mouth to ns include the bronchial aperture mouth bronchial siphon sphincter peripharyngeal bands esophagus right left and left liver lobe stomach intestine inter intestinal loop rectum and ns the alimentary canal the alimentary canal is the most important part of the digestive system of hardmania the digestive tract of hardmania is coiled and complete it's begin at the mouth and terminating at the ns the alimentary canal have the following parts mouth the mouth or bronchial aperture open on the top of bronchial siphon marking the anterior end of the body bordered by four lips or lobes formed by the test buccal cavity the buccal cavity is short narrow and laterally compressed cavity of bronchial siphon which is lined by the epidermis it is called the stomodium or buccal cavity bronchial cavity have bronchial tentacles which is richly blood supply with nerves bronchial tentacles is sickle shaped attached by its broad base the lower border of tentacles is thin lobed notched and curved by glandular epithelium the bronchial tentacles are 64 in number broadly in four sides epithe uh, four sides eighth large 5 mm eight medium 2.5 mm 16 small they are 1.5 mm and every small 32.5 mm small pharynx buccal cavity or bronchial siphon is followed pharynx pharynx is the major part of the body it is differentiated into peripharyngeal peribronchial zone and a bronchial sac prebronchial zone it is the smaller anterior region which having a smooth wall without folds cilia and stigmata or gill slits bronchial sac by two circular thin parallel and ciliated ridges which is called anterior and posterior peripharyngeal bands which is enclosing a narrow ciliated peripharyngeal groove the peripharyngeal groove have smaller and larger cilia in the groove anterior peripharyngeal band is complete rings bronchial sac posterior region of pharynx is large it is known as bronchial basket because it look like the basket it its lateral wall is perforated by numerous elongated gill slits of stigmata pharynx cavity is communicate with the atrial cavity the bronchial sac bs about 2 lakh stigmata which are arranged in transverse rows the stigmata bs long cilia that is called as little cilia the pharyngeal wall consists of a network of broad longitudinal and transverse b transverse bs at the regular intervals 
the stigmata are have five or six stigmata have rich blood supply due to the blood vessels here internal and external transverse vessels are present trabeculi branchial sac inner wall become folded longitudinally it increase the surface area 9 or 10 branchial fold is either side inner surface non ciliated the branchial sac outer wall consists to several hollow stents by nestalk called trabeculi each trabeculi containing blood vessels dorsal lamella it is 1 to 1.5 cm long thin flap or folds it's suspended from the short middle border of the roof of branchial sac called hepat hypopharyngeal bands or dorsal lamina it is spread spread from the posterior peripharyngeal band to the right tip of the esophagus opening 20 to 30 conical rows tapering tongue like process lengthwise it is the it is hang down from dorsal lamina into the branchial sac cavity lengthwise curved by cilia ciliated epithelium and style a shell shallow longitudinal mid ventral groove called endostyle endostyle is present on the floor of the branchial sac the endostyle consists of five longitudinal cilia tract one median two longitudinal pierces four longitudinal tentacle tracts of mucus secreting glands cells median cilia are the Large, longest of all. Esophageal area. The posterior region of branchial sac has small circular esophageal area. It is made up of two semicircular lips, guarding the esophageal openings. Esophagus. Esophagus branchial sac leads posterior posterior dorsally. into the esophagus esophagus is very short curved and thick walled tube opening into stomach a passage for food have four longitudinal grooves stomach stomach is wider than the esophagus have inner surface smooth stomach is surrounded by the left and right liver lobe which secrete the bile juice for help the digestion of food intestine intestine the stomach is leads into the intestine it is a u shaped tube it formed by proximal ventral or descending limb and distal dorsal or ascending limbs both united intestine the stomach leads into the intestine rectum rectum is terminal part of intestine it leads into a short narrow tube the rectum rectum is lined by cilia internally it curved dorsally to open into the atrium or cloaca through the anus it bounded by four lips cloaca cloaca leads dorsally into the atrial siphon which open outside through the atrial aperture 
द एटेल साइफन लाइंड इंटरनली बाय एक्टोडम इट रिप्रेजेंट द प्रोक्टोडियम सम डाइजेस्टिव ग्लैंड आर प्रजेंट इन दी हडमानिया हडमानिया हैव टू ग्लैंड विच हेल्प इन टू दी फूड डाइजेशन लीवर विच इज लीवर इज डार्क ब्राउन बायलॉब्ड डाइजेस्टिव ग्लैंड विच हैव राइट एंड लेफ्ट लीवर लोब राइट लीवर लोब इज स्मॉल देन द लेफ्ट लीवर लोब द लीवर अटैच टू द स्टोमक हैव लार्ज नंबर ऑफ ट्यूबरकुली सिकी विच एम्बेडेड इन टू कनेक्टिव टिश्यू एंड मेट्रिक्स कंटेनिंग ब्लड साइनस टेन टू ट्वेल्व ट्यूबर ट्यूब्यूल्स यूनाइट एंड हेपेटिक डक्ट द हेपेटिक डक्ट ओपन इंडिपेंडेंटली इन टू स्टमक लीवर सिक्रीशन हैव स्ट्रोंग अमाइलेस प्रोक्टोज माइल्ड लाइपेज पायलोरिक ग्लैंड पायलोरिक स्टमक इज कंसिस्ट ऑफ लार्ज नंबर ऑफ ब्रांचिंग ट्यूब्यूल दे ओपन इन टू द स्टोमक एंड इंटेस्टाइन पायलोरिक ग्लैंड परफोरेटिव परफॉर्म ड्यूअल फंक्शन फूड एंड फीडिंग हडमानिया इज सेडेंट्री एनिमल एंड दे आर सीलियर फीडर एज वेल एज फिल्टर फीडर फूड देयर फूड इज माइक्रोस्कोपिक प्लैंगटोनिक्स ऑर्गेनिम्स सच एज एलगी डाइटम्स एट्सेट्रा